Let's go. So on the next example, perfect. Um, over on this example, again, we, you can look at the parent function. f of x equals log of x. So therefore, we can identify if we're applying a transformation inside or outside of the function. Um, we can see I'm not multiplying, again, anything outside of it here. Again, I am adding a 3 on the inside. So why are, we, why are we having trouble with this? So in the, oh, OK. But I still want you to use 3. Okay. So we have log of x plus 3. Um, so adding 3, I'm adding it inside the parentheses. So you can say a uh, horizontal. Uh, I'm sorry. Yeah. Horizontal shift three units left. Then the only other thing I'm doing is I'm subtracting a two, but that two I'm not subtracting inside the parentheses, I'm subtracting outside the parentheses. So we can say that's a um, vertical shift two down. Does everybody see the difference there? Remember horizontals are always the opposite direction. Now we need to sketch the graph. So we need to make sure we understand what the graph looks like. So we go back over, look at our notes, or look at what the graph that I have provided for you, and see that the logarithmic function looks like this. It has an x-intercept at 1, 0, and also has an asymptote at x equals 0. That's really, really important for us to remember. Really, really important. So that's the graph. Um, you can see I'm going left 3. So 1, 2, 3, and then down 2. 1, 2. Now, if I'm shifting it left 3, the x-intercept moved left 3. But what else moved left 3? This vertical asymptote. So my graph should look something like that. Actually, let me do it in red. So the graph should look something like that. If you go around that way, it's OK. Um, now, let's do the last one is the domain range. The domain, how far to the left is my graph going? How far to the left is going? Negative 3, is that included or not included? Not included, I put parentheses. But you guys see how this one, how it was included, right? Because there's a point there. There's no point there. It's an asymptote, so it's not included. And then it goes to infinity to the right. The range, how low does this graph go? How high is it going to go? Infinity. And there you go. Done.